Grand Bahamas economy has gone through a tremendous amount of adversity in the past, but Minister of Tourism Obi Wilshkom says that the new Memories Grand Bahama Beach Resort will serve as the catalyst for a major shift in Grand Bahamas tourism industry. Sunwing is a major brand. He brings not only the opportunity to cause for more brands to be on the island, he brings the opportunity to cause for occupancy levels to range around 80 percent and he also has uh, the capacity to fly in and cause further distribution because he has planes. He has uh, 33 air airplanes and so he's able to cause people to come to the island and cause distribution to the other parts of the island. So this is very significant but having him as a player at the table is even more significant. For more details on this and other stories, visit us online at tourismtoday.com. Now, also on Facebook and Twitter. Grand Bahamas economy has gone through a tremendous amount of adversity in the past, but Minister of Tourism Obi Wilshkom says that the new Memories Grand Bahama Beach Resort will serve as the catalyst for a major shift in Grand Bahamas tourism industry. Sunwing is a major brand. He brings not only the opportunity to cause for more brands to be on the island, he brings the opportunity to cause for occupancy levels to range around 80 percent and he also has uh, the capacity to fly in and cause further distribution because he has planes. He has uh, 33 air airplanes and so he's able to cause people to come to the island and cause distribution to the other parts of the island. So this is very significant but having him as a player at the table is even more significant. The age-old complaint that travelers who stay at inclusive resorts seldom venture out into surrounding communities thus spreading the economic impact does not hold true for Grand Bahama. Minister Wilchcombe says that Memories is an all-inclusive resort that is in fact working for all of Grand Bahama. All-inclusive are wonderful because you're seeing many people move away from the EP uh, to the all-inclusive. All-inclusive before had the uh, perception that they were all intended because of their discovery. It was all in because people went to uh, the all-inclusive to get away from the crime and the social despair. Uh, but what, has, what we've seen is that people come to all-inclusives, but they don't want to stay in the all-inclusive. What it does is guarantees their room and their occupancy levels and food for the entire week. But what they do is they come in, they spend a day or two, then they want to go out. Because we're seeing the increase in the number of tours on the island. We're seeing an increase in the spend over at Port Lucaya. And because of this location, it's almost like everything's here. So you don't want to stay in this place. You want to get out. The nation's leaning tourism authority says that the location of memories also adds to its winning appeal. And he proudly boasts that Grand Bahama is on the verge of an economic explosion. It's very much like uh, Las Vegas, the Strip. And if we can cause for all the hotels on this strip to come alive, if we can cause for more entertainment because we place an emphasis on culture, if we can cause for more to happen, you're going to see this particular part of Grand Bahama just blow up and you're going to see the rest of the island grow. Already we're seeing 37% increase in terms of arrivals. Well, that's compared to last year and we haven't really started yet. Uh, just imagine where this is going to go. It's going to be the fastest recovering island and the fastest growing tourism destination. For more details on this and other stories, visit us online at tourismtoday.com. Now, also on Facebook and Twitter.